you guys real quick about something. I'm going to throw a few verses at you, okay? The first one is, you guys are all up to hear this. Children, obey your parents in the Lord, for this is right. Honor your father and mother, which is the first commandment with a promise, that it may go well with you and that you may enjoy long life on the earth. And like two, two books over in the Bible, it says, in Colossians 3.20, Children, obey your parents in everything, for this pleases the Lord. Then, kind of on the same lines, but doing better in life, it says, Do not let this book of the law depart from your mouth. Meditate on it day and night, so that you may be careful to do everything written in it. Then you will be prosperous and successful. And then one last verse is Jeremiah 29, 11. And some of you might know it, but it says, let's just find it real quick. For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord. Plans to prosper you and not to harm you. Plans to give you hope and a future. Okay, so how many here know that before you were even born, God had your whole life planned for you? You guys know that? Like four people? Hold on. How many of you people know that before you were born, God had your whole life planned for you? All right, ten people. That's a little bit better. So, what I'm telling you guys tonight is, and I'm saying this because there's one person in here that's like a little brother to me, and I've been trying to beat this into his head this week. I'm telling you, your parents love you. They make you do things that you don't want to do, but it's because they've been through those things and they want to make your life better, okay? So, you need to listen to your parents, obey your parents, and prosper and be successful in life, all right? That's all I got.